Good evening, I'm Dave Sess. A house fire in East Liverpool killed two people. They never made it out. And why is only one of the questions which still needs to be answered. 27 First News reporter Derek Lewis was on the scene today and has the details new at 11. Family and friends say Jerry Bibby and his five-year-old son Bryce died this morning in that fire. It has been a tough day for them trying to process the loss of their loved ones. Grieving family and friends visit the site on Old Lincoln Highway where a father and son lost their lives early Tuesday morning. They tried to put together the pieces from what's left. Something definitely isn't right. Um, he was too prepared for this. He, he was prepared for every situation that you could possibly think of. Troy Daniels owned an indoor flea market with one of the victims, Jerry Bibby, who lived here with his five-year-old son, Bryce. Both were pronounced dead at the scene. I see Bryce, you know, every day. Um, he's charming, uh, full, full life. Um, the sky was the limit for him. His dad was making sure sky was the limit for him. West Point firefighters were called to the house a few minutes before 2 o'clock Tuesday morning. It took four fire departments three hours to put out the fire. Not only did they have to battle the flames, ammunition was stored inside that exploded during the fire. Family members close to the veterans say after Jerry lost his parents, little Bryce lost his mother in a car accident. He was really good father. I uh, was impressed. Jerry's uncle Charles made a second trip back. When he visited the home earlier, as the flames were still burning, he didn't know whether his nephews made it out. There was no answers on the telephones, calling his phone, and there nobody knew that he was gone anywhere. All the vehicles were here. I mean, it was sort of obvious, but, but uh, you know, never want to give up hope. Troy says moving on will be tough. I don't think I'll, my heart will ever recover from such a tragic loss of either one of them. Now, investigators are looking into the cause of the fire. Family members tell me they are now making arrangements to remember the father and son who lost their lives. Dave?